love in Milan. Welcome to this vlog. I know I have gone on about this trip for so long. It is basically a joint birthday holiday for my boyfriend and I. It was his birthday yesterday. So we're here for a few days and we're gonna live it up. The sun is beautiful, the weather's amazing. We're gonna take a stroll outside and take some pictures, have some lunch, and then we've actually got a dinner reservation tonight. We'll be going to the Cavalli Club restaurant. He doesn't know it's a surprise. Before you guys ask, yes, I have done a room tour, hotel room tour. I was not looking great. This is literally as we stepped in, I was tired. I had sleep in my eyes. I had sweated out my makeup. My hair was a mess, but I had to capture it for you guys. So enjoy the room tour. So I've just come in and this is exactly what I see. Some steps and right here, there is a huge mirror. Um, but this door, which is really cool because it's slidey, is the bathroom. So we've got a nice like a shower area here it's absolutely stunning and then we have the sink which is really really nice and i really love this mirror you know that we bloggers always complain about hotel lighting well this is perfect when i'm doing my makeup as you can see my makeup does not look very great because i have been on the plane and had delays today but we made it and just here is the toilet and the bidet area we've also got some robes and some slippers oh i love them okay now you come out here and you have this area where i guess you can hang up your coats and your luggage bedroom this is what i'm talking about guys this is so so nice so me you guys know i love quilted i love bedside lights it's just such a big bed as well it's so much bigger than my bed at home definitely going to enjoy that and just over here there's like loads of shelving and cupboard space so i don't even know what's in there let's see literally just cupboard space and they've left us like a really cute magazine thank you i guess this might actually show me some places to go so opposite the bed we have this like desk area tv we can make our teas and our hot chocolates and i've got a cute little note here saying welcome and oh they look so so good thank you the room service menu and a guide of the hotel look how stunning it is we have another big mirror. So, isn't it stunning? It's the Lagar Hotel in Milan, and it's by the Sofitel, and it's also called the M Gallery Hotel, so there are various different names. I will be sure to leave the link down below. I'm gonna show you guys around the rest of the hotel. There's a spa, there's a gym, there's a roof terrace and bar, there's a restaurant. It's absolutely amazing. To be honest, you don't really need to leave this place because there's everything you could ever want, but we are going to explore Milan because we have never been here before. I'm so excited. I don't know if you guys can tell. So this is our map of Milano. We are here and um, there is like a station right near us. An amazing receptionist actually. He's so so lovely. He literally circled all the key areas and showed us where places were just on the map just really really helpful so today we're doing lunch we're gonna like browse around on their sort of equivalent of oxford street which is just here so not far from us <laughs> I know it has like graffiti on it, but I feel like that just adds to the Europeanness. So we wanted to be cool and use the maps. However, we decided why not use Google Maps on our phones? It just makes sense. <laughs> so now we know it's 10 minutes and we're heading in the right direction. You know when Sicily is his favorite shop, well one of, we gotta have a look. This is cookies or Nutella. That's bueno, isn't it? No, is it? Kind of. That looks alright. Yes, that's the peaches. I don't understand how the two correlate. What's that you're picking up? <laughs> you can't decide between chocolate chip cookies because there's so many. They've shown us the bag. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> This is so cute. 
so it's time for us to leave and I don't really want to go but we need to go and eat now and really we haven't eaten all day we're gonna head out we're gonna go we're gonna get changed and I will see you guys when I look nice I'm back I'm back I'm back who knows who knows Hey guys, so now I'm going out to eat. We're going to the Cavalli Club and we're gonna eat, we're gonna party. It turns into a really nice club as well at night, so I can not wait. We can sit out here, babe. Today is day two and it's gonna be a busy one. We're up, it's actually 11.30. We were meant to leave out at 11. We slept in a little bit today because last night was amazing. My camera died so I didn't get to film everything I wanted to at the Cavalli Club, but it was so, so nice. The food was lovely. So we're gonna do all of the touristy things today and eat loads and just explore. And again, the weather is stunning. Yes, my name. Oh no, so cute. I just want some nice white trainers. So you look nice today. because I want, I really do want some Gucci trainers and I'm very tempted. So we shall see what happens when we go into Gucci. You think it's too thin? What do you think this though? asking someone to charge it in a store and buying a new power bank which I have on me now so I can charge it. Only now my phone's dying, it's on 13% so I now need to go and buy an iPhone wire handled right now followed in the square. I want some wine, some everything. Oh, 
woke up from a nap and I have to tell you it's probably the best sleep I've had <laughs> since being here. I was just so exhausted from the walking around and the heat outside so I came and had a nap and now I'm up ready to head downstairs to the spa. just come up to the terrace I just wanted to take in the view behind me it's so stunning guess where we are we are on the metro day three and we are finally in the queue to get our tickets for the Duma I'm not sure whether we're gonna go all the way up or not I was worried because I thought that I had to come around but I'm seeing the people in the queue and the people are wearing less than me and this is the queue actually not very long at all to be honest it's moving we're moving so guys i don't know if you can see me but we just got our tickets and i've got a little jacket to cover my knees um we're gonna enter that queue there and then we're gonna climb all the hundred and odd hundreds of steps up the dumo and burn but it's worth it isn't it when you're in italy when you're in milan this is just something you have to do and then i think after that i'm definitely going to deserve some gelato so my boyfriend and i've been arguing because he says that it's a gelato but i've never heard that before i always hear people say gelato so i'm gonna ask a real italian when we get there and um finally put this thing to rest Work out. 
out in itself. That's it for the week. Leave it. Wow. This is nice. This is so stunning. Using the selfie stick over there. Have to. Um, I'm really risking it all right now. Can you see where my hand is? Here. Luckily, I mean, it goes to there. But I doubt anyone can even get up there, so. I'm not gonna risk it. I'm going, you can actually see my hair color now. And just like that, we are turning around and we're going right back down all of those steps. So wish us luck, guys. Bye. Do you reckon we can get the lift back down? Thank you. the grounds of the castle and I'm just gonna take a walk around and see what it's like <laughs> We really wanted to rent some bikes, however, their bike system is not like London where you can literally just pay as you go. You have to like subscribe, so we're deciding where to go next. And there is also a museum behind us. <laughs> <laughs> 